Hi everybody, so this is it. My studio's all set up, ready and raring to go. So let me give you a quick tour. So this is it, it's finished. It went up amazingly quick. It took the builders a day and a, well, it took one guy a day to put the base down and then the builders two days or a day and a half to actually um, erect the building and um, another day to paint the interior and the exterior. So it's ready for me to move in. I cannot wait. I've got a few things in here already. If we go inside, this is it. Let's get everything else in and I'll be right back. So this is it, I've got everything in. I'm just standing at the doors, the front doors to the unit. So I'm just gonna go in and show you how I've set it up. As you walk in, I have a nice comfy chair. That's for when uh, friends come round and we wanna have a bit of a jam with the guitars. Uh, I've got an easel there. That easel's going. I'm going to get a proper studio easel. I've got a couple of prints on the wall. Of uh, These prints were bought for me by my daughters because uh, one of my, well, my all-time favourite album is Songs in the Key of Life by Stevie Wonder. Uh, so they bought me those because they know how much I like Stevie Wonder. Uh, I've got a couple of easels stashed up down here. Uh, that I'm going to start doing some real painting on real, not real painting. It's all real painting, traditional painting. I mean to say, uh, I'm talking about real uh, traditional paintings. Here's a couple of drawings that I did. Um, this one's quite interesting. These are traditional done with pencil and in ink tense pencils. And this one's called fairy book. Got a couple of little fairies there playing on fairy book and then this one we've got them um playing ukuleles and the two fairies in the drawings are actually my daughters they post for me for these they really put up with me a lot and then i've got a desk uh, sorry a set of drawers there i've got my portfolio tucked away nice and neat out of the way so that's like the traditional area where I'm going to be doing traditional painting. And then we move to this half of the studio. And this is where all the digital work's done. So I've got my lights set up now. I've got a couple of studio lights in there. I'm about to put the green screen up when I want it. Moving around here. We have the uh, two monitors. I've got my uh, regular monitor and the Cintiq Rhodes microphone for um, doing the audio. This desk, absolutely mental because uh, it moves up and down if I get it to work. There we go. Check that out. That's going up. This time with all the kit on. Bit worried about my cup, it's not gonna catch the webcam. No, that's cool. I need a mouse mount. This is a glass top, uh, so I'm using that uh, pad at the minute. So I'm gonna have to get a, a mouse mount. And then down here, I've got like a 20 year old stereo system, which is hooked up into the PC. So that's, uh, I can be listening to music and stuff and I'm working. So that's all very cool. And I've got my uh, 500 watt rumble fender bass amp there for when I'm gigging. So that's just going to live there out of the way. Eat uh, another chair for when people are sat at the side of me and I'm discussing artwork with them. And a bass guitar and an acoustic guitar. And then the view out of the window, we're looking at that. So all day long I can get inspired. Um, looking at this view so long as I don't go this way and look at the uh, building yard 
as it is just at the minute. Uh, we're working on the fire pit area. That's coming along nicely. That won't be long before it's done. But that's going to be this area that I'm showing you now is next year's project. So as long as I look after this window, everything's groovy and I'm happy and I can be inspired. So this is it. This is my new studio, all set up and raring to go. I can't wait. I'm going to do some drawing right now. So I hope you've enjoyed this video. If you have, big thumbs up, always much appreciated. And if you're new to the channel, please consider subscribing because I've got lots of videos like this and I would love to be sharing them with you. So hopefully I'll see you all in the next one. Bye.